capped an astonishing 40 consecutive times for his country, he made his debut in 1954 against France. He retired at the age of 29. During his career, he captained his beloved Hoik and later became president of the club. At the recent Hoik dinner to announce the Greens' greatest ever team, he was one of the first on the list. Current president Rory Bannerman spoke to him at that event. Well, as a boy who had great legends to follow, we've already mentioned a lot of names, Willie Welsh, Jerry Foster, Doug Davis, they're just a few of the boys. And you followed these boys and that was their target. Superb, and you did it all the way up to the Lions, so that must be quite something as well. It's a long time. <laughs> it's a long road. <laughs> well, you got there, and you got there with pride, and uh, the whole town's behind you when you did it, and they are now. So thank you very much for being part of the greatest ever team. Another great Scottish prop, Ian Milne, paid his own tribute that night. I don't know you that well, Hugh, but what an incredible record you've had. Two Lions trips, six tests in a row, retired at 29 a real legend of the game of rugby and a hero and inspiration to me when I was an 11-year-old boy. It was a pleasure about it. Hugh McLeod of Hoyk, who died last night at the age of 81.